30 lengths of the pool for Bobby Fink and company. Fink, by the way, now with six Olympic and World Championship medals. This race is kind of fun for me to watch. Like you, you know, for me, I, I'm always looking at technique, at stroke, at, at kick, all of these fine points in freestyle. And if you see the distance, guys, it's the same kind of rate. Their kick is the same throughout the whole entire mile. And, and that's just what they train for every single day. You know, it's completely different training for a distance event than it is training for my events. Um, so these guys spend a lot longer time in the pool, a lot more time really focused on trying to hit those repeats. So, you know, you'll, you'll hear us later in the race talking about maybe 29 second 50s, 28 second 50s, 30 second 50s, just holding that throughout. Did you swim this? Oh, uh, I used to have to swim it once a year. Uh, <laughs> Bob would make me uh, make me get in here and do it for training purposes. I at a meet? I, at a meet, yeah. I think I went like 15, 30 something. That's pretty good. That's it not bad. Okay. It's Katie, okay. Katie only beat you by 10 seconds? I, I, I was trying to hope nobody would bring, bring that up, but yes. That's pretty good though. Bobby, the first American to win Olympic gold in this event in 40 years. Michael O'Brien, you got to go back before Fink won gold in Tokyo. And so that was a rare feat for an American. And Michael, when you talk about Australia, they've got this kind of long distance mentality. Even though there have been some Olympic gold medal winners from the United States in the past, it's not exactly one of those sports that has always been on the foremost of the minds of America when they watch every four years Olympic swimming. Of course, of course. You know, Australians have really owned the distance events for a long time. You know, Kieran Perkins, Graham Hackett, these guys are some of the greatest distance swimmers the world's ever seen. And, you know, Bobby's really, really putting a challenge to that. You know, he's, he's the greatest mile that we've seen in quite some time. And, you know, he swims it in a, in a completely different way. You know, that speed coming down the last hundred is, is second to none. Yep, you're right, Whitlock made his first Olympic team when he finished second behind Fink in that 800 and right now he's the second youngest member of the team 17 year old Thomas Heilman who won the 200 fly another 17 year old but David Johnston trying to get himself an Olympic berth as we approach the bell lap for Bobby Fink signaling two lengths to go Fink just about ready to wrap up another Olympic berth in the 1500. And ladies and gentlemen, watch his legs this 50, or this 100, excuse me. He really starts to drop them there. Just hammers it. It's so fun watching him on last 100. And David Johnson now has a full body length lead over Whitlock. So David Johnson seems intent on getting himself on the Olympic team. David Johnson's also up on that lane line. So if Whitlock wants to get a little ride, he can hop on it and look it, what he's doing right now. And, and you know the great thing about Johnson, he's been third in the 400, fourth in the 800. So this, this guy is two. Johnson will have a pretty good lead on Whitlock as they make the turn for home. In the meantime, there's about 25 meters for Bobby Fink to make it official. Double gold in Tokyo and setting himself up for another run at two Olympic golds in the 800 and the 1500. In the meantime, David Johnston trying to put himself on his first Olympic team. Looking strong. Whitlock below him in lane six is trying to make a run here. Doing everything he can, but Johnston just has enough to lock up a spot. Luke Whitlock, Luke Whitlock, 27-7 <laughs> last 50. Whoa. That is the best time for David Johnston by some 10 seconds. And to do it again here, remember we said that stat yesterday, less than 25% of people do best times at Olympic trials. And the to, last day. And to drop 10 seconds. <laughs> Man, he was ready to go. And to put yourself on the Olympic team Correct. for the Correct. first time. That's a, lot dream. To, that's a lot to absorb for him. 22-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby.